The Novena to Our Lady of the Assumption, Day 6. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you have destroyed the power of death and given the hope of eternal life in body and soul. You granted your mother a special place in your glory and did not allow decay to touch her body. As we rejoice in the Assumption of Mary, give to us a renewed confidence in the victory of life over death. You live and reign forever and ever. Amen. Day 6. We Reflect on Offering Let us contemplate Mary as she offers her Son to the Father. It is a providentially powerful moment when Mary feels Jesus is truly her own. He is not only her son, but also her redeemer. At the foot of the cross stood his mother. Mary understands and feels the rending pain of her offering, but she also experiences her mysterious fruitfulness. Never has she ever felt so alone. Her son dies. But never also has she ever felt accompanied and even more fruitful. The church is born. Behold your Son, the Church, humanity. The world cannot live without Christ. God so loved the world that he gave his only Son. Today the world cannot live without the Church, the body of Christ. Everything is fruit of the love of the Father, but everything too is fruit of the generosity, so serene and strong, painful and fruitful, of Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Let us pray. Eternal Father, you graciously looked upon the humility of the Blessed Virgin Mary and made her to be the mother of the Word incarnate, Jesus Christ our Lord. Grant, we beseech you, that we who honor her assumption into the kingdom of heaven may, by her motherly intercession, also come to share in the inheritance of those whom you have redeemed by the precious blood of your Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to your protection, implored your help, or sought your intercession was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto you, O Virgin of Virgins, my mother. To you do I come, before you I stand, sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not my petitions, but in your mercy hear and answer me. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.